Right now we are at uh, Kodangal area of uh, Telangana where uh, TPCC chief Revanth Reddy is uh, going to contest his upcoming uh, polls. Right now he is become the uh, boom for Telangana who can uh, mostly we can say he is right uh, opposite to KCR at this moment of politics. We are joined by his brother here. He's uh, uh, you know similarly look alike to uh, Revanth Reddy ji in your walking style, your speaking style, everything is look alike like Revanth Reddy ji. So tell us about Revanth Reddy ji mainly and your uh, uh, th this appearance that you have. Do people get confused between you both? Not really sometimes, but you know we look same, <coughs> but we. I'm not into politics, so he is a star campaigner of Telangana, and he's a PCC president, so he recognizes more people like you know. So uh, since the time I've come here, I'm listening to people. They are just shouting upcoming CM, upcoming CM. So what is this boom about the Congress Party? Has it, you know, uh, it, it has become a uh, in this mainly if you see Kodangal, this area is they think the, their star is Revanth Reddy. So now that he's contesting from here, what will it be for the people of Kodangal as as a brother? How do you see his political career here in? Uh, yeah, basically, basically Revan Reddy has started political career here in in, Tal, in Konak, Kodangal. So since in, in 2009, when that time we, we we had a last day of nomination and within 15 days people wanted him as a MLA. But after that, since 2009, we've been working here and we are with we are with we have a Kodangal becoming like a family. So whenever he is there looking at is looking at looking at him as a family member, so they own him. So we do, we don't own him now anymore. So they Kodangal people own him. So, so it, is, it is not your brother, but the whole Kodangal uh, brother. You can yeah, say family. As, as a blood brother, is my brother, but he's a Kodangal brother, son, whatever it is. So people taking him as a Kodangal. Uh, like a brother, son, whatever. So, uh, so basically what we see is that he has gained a lot of success, we can say, become from becoming to, uh, TPCC chief to getting Congress at this graph here is not an easy task. So as a family member, how do you see him? When a family, is he always stressed, always talking political, or is he you know, uh, good with the fa maintaining balance between the family life and political life? But w w what we see is very, he, he, every time when we see him out as a politician, that's it. So you as a brother, how do you see him? We see my, we, he segregate is a family and a politics in between, you know, he has his own time uh, schedules. So he give enough time to family as well as the economist political. So most likely, you know, we don't bother him as a family member that we need uh, my brother, uh, sister, or daughter, whoever it is, they don't bother him because we have, we are get used to it. So he's busy. So we don't want to give, we want to give him his, you know, his enough time to him. So we don't never touch anything is personal things or personal uh, you know we take care of everything so you just give him to politics so how do you see uh, that uh, as a family member uh, you are here but how do you see his uh, growth can you describe some memorable moments that you have seen him as a brother uh, you know a proud feeling that you see or some uh, points where he has gone to i mean uh, he's, he's uh, very sad and upset and you were there for him some memorable moments that you can I can say when we lost in 2008, uh, 18 elections in Kodangal, people was very upset Kodangal, what happened they don't know. But very next day I met him, he was very cool, he said it's, it happened, this is politics. So don't take it personal, politics. So we, we will get another opportunity to go for it, we will go for it. So we've been there as a MP, MP Malkaj Giri, we won there and now after that he became a chief uh, PCC president of Telangana and that's a very memorable, you know, in the family and once we won the elections right after, right after he, he became a PCC president, then he became a C, uh, CM candidature of, uh, you know, Telangana, people accept, accepting him. 90% of people, you know, they are in Telangana also, not only Kodangal. In Telangana also, people wants to see him as a CM. So that is a memorable uh, moment for us. You know, when we met as a family member, oh, would be CM brother is coming. So, so as, a as a brother, you hope that he becomes the CM soon, huh? Ah, I, 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 I'm not hoping he's, he's going to become as a CM on December 3rd. So that is what we expect. So what, what we see is whenever Rahul Gandhi is here, whenever the top bosses are here from the Congress party, Revan Reddy has been growing. And, I've, and during the rallies, I've heard that he's called the second Rahul Gandhi of Telangana. So what what is it exactly? How is this equation being created? Basically, I don't I don't I don't 
say I can't say that is the second second uh, Rahul Gandhi of Telangana, but you know similar age and their personality, everything looks is the same. But people, you know, uh, Telangana people uh, looking in Raven Reddy, Rahul Gandhi. That is what I feel most of the times because he, they have very good rapo and they uh, take care of each other very nice in when they are in Telangana and the work style also looks all the same. That is what I feel as a family member. So he's a hard worker, Raven Reddy. Maybe that is why that is why he getting appreciation of uh, second uh, Rahul Gandhi of Telangana. That is what I feel. So as a family member, as a brother, how do you see his discipline, his loyalty, his uh, you know the, the habits, the attitude that he's having towards the family, towards the party workers? How do you admire those? What do you uh, see as the most admirable qualities in Raymond Reddy? I can say one thing: he's a very disciplined leader. He, 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 he's a very disciplined leader, and he work hard. He work 14 to 18 hours a day. So we want to learn him so much from him, we learn so much from him and uh, you know most of the times he's with people so we we always like you know whenever in the middle of the day if we want to see him also he's in the middle of the uh, people so we can't see him that is the only thing it's a sad thing but you know everything else is good. I've been here for more than uh, I think one hour and I'm seeing you are just continuously giving you know, people are coming and approaching for photographs and you I, I've been seeing there's a lot of crowd who's coming and approaching for photographs so how do you feel as uh, you know you, you're not into politics but the attraction that you get how do you feel about it? I feel sometimes happy I, I scared sometimes most of the times I feel happy but you know sometimes I get, I scared also because I, I I look similar to him people say that if I did something wrong, it's maybe it's going to be affecting. So that is scared me. So I'm scared of sometimes. So what, what is the age gap between you both? Maybe six years. Six years. So you were anger to him. Anger to him, yeah. <laughs> so what do you see in the upcoming days? Who do you think is the main opponent that he has to beat here in the politics, be it in the politics that he's facing right now? Is it the Congress party? Is it the BRS party? What is the main opponent, is the main challenge for him for the upcoming poll? He wants to beat him KCR. That's the challenge. He wants to beat KCR. That's the challenge. Whether TRS party, BRS party, whoever it is. But we want to beat him in KCR. He wants to beat him in KCR. All the best to you, sir. Nice meeting you. And uh, similarly, you look alike, uh, like Revath Reddy's sir. Thank you so much. So this was Revath Reddy's brother with us, with camera person Damodar, Abdul Bashir, Hedra, Kodangal.